we who draw do so not only to make something observed visible to others but also to accompany something invisible to its incalculable destination. The human body, corpus humanum, is composed of many individuals of different nature, each one of which is highly composite. We were born on the same day, the 5th of November. To say that we have a lot of things in common ah, is complicated, mm. but also there is something that we share quite mysterious but very deeply. The human body needs for its preservation many other bodies from which it is, so to speak, continually regenerated. And sometimes I think that it's as though in another life uh, we met or did something. The individuals composing the human body, and consequently the human body itself, is affected in many ways by external bodies. Not in the sense of uh, reincarnation, ah, it's mm -hmm. not that. Uh, uh, because what's important about this, if it is like that, is that we are aware of it in some department which isn't memory although it's quite close to memory of this thing uh, maybe that in another life we touched together and then I think for myself thinking like that I think well and maybe maybe we made an appointment to see each other again in this life okay 5th of November but it wasn't the same year. That didn't matter. We weren't in that kind of time. Like we got off at the same station. Exactly. Mm. We got off at the same station. When a fluid part of the human body is so determined by an external body that it impinges frequently on another part which is soft, it changes its surface and as it were, imprints on it the traces of the external impelling body. We mortals know only too well that time is in our mouths and hands and feet and that change is all we have to rely upon. And when I reach now for a gesture that reconciles me to the triumph that human art can be. I think about that gleam in the lip of the glass that a woman brought to her lips 500 years ago and the precision with which her artist witnessed that moment or rather that pose depicting that moment and the magical whisper of movement behind the limbo, the sound and smells and temperature from the street below. Imagine all these gestures hung in time and logic and human experience, all about inarticulacy, stretching towards communication and life good old life itself, ticking by forever, but here bottled like the genie in oil and framed like a magic window for curious human aliens. <laughs> 